it snowed. Time to go out and shovel. Welcome to my let's shovel for New Hampshire. So what are we what are we shoveling with today? Well I'm showing that we have a yellow or a red shovel. I think we're gonna go with the yellow one. Let's take a look at outside. Oh my god. So bright. Oh, some of it's already done. You know it's been a really bad storm when even your door needs shoveling. It's starting to look a little creepy. Oh, but it goes off in the wrong direction. My path is this way. Hello, Appa. That's my car, Appa. All right, well, I guess let's get to work. And we begin. Oh. I'm going to speed this up later. This music or something. I don't want to be doing this. Nobody wants to be watching this. <laughs> I'm two seconds in and already I'm done. So my goal is to shovel out this way and in the back of the car because if I get lazy then I can just leave that and won't have to worry about it. We are shoveling the snow out into the driveway because that's why we pay for a plow guy. It's because with a hill on one side and your neighbor's parking on the other very weird to shovel out our area. Alright, back to work I guess. Chill your drink. Very important to stay hydrated. So the trick with your car when you have a plow guy is to not empty it out in the spot where you're responsible. You back up and empty it out where he's responsible. It's not going to affect the driving of anybody, but it's not going to kill you. Like I, very unhealthy. So I'm going to bring it back. We're going to do that and clear off the car back here. Also give me more room and try to clear out there. Let's do it. Thank <laughs> you. 
make sure you plan a solid two to three hours to clean out your car and your parking space. And the reason is, is because living in New Hampshire kind of sucks. But that's the price you pay for no big spiders that will kill you, no alligators, and not having to live next to Florida man. One, one, what am I supposed to do with you? I need two. All right, so make sure to stay hydrated or you're gonna die. We're almost at the end of this video because I'm almost at the end of my battery supply. So I'm gonna go and clean up my spot a little bit and then put the car back. All right, I'm seriously almost out of battery, so I'm gonna do my end screen now. At the end of clearing off your car and your area, please be wary of cars and areas around you. It's a nice thing to clear them off, but you don't have to. It's just nice. I, for one, might or might not, depending on how I feel when I finish. I'm probably not. Sorry, Abigail. All right, let's get back and let's see how long these batteries last. I'm saving my last shot for the, the massive amount of batteries used in this video. as possible but since this is like June ish and uh, most people not it's, it's uh, halfway through March but since it's spring and this crap should be over I don't care if it forms ice or gets bumpy we've only got about another month of this tops so but normally this is in December or in January, I want to shovel as much as possible because it'll melt, it'll harden, and you'll never get rid of it all. You'll just screw up your parking spot. It'll be awful. And this is it. This is it. This is how many batteries died in the making of this video. That's it. Look at that. An entire box and one left. What a waste. What a waste. One one left. And so please make sure you recycle your batteries because batteries are awful. And if you're Duracell or a battery company, this is ridiculous. This is really sad. Either my camera or my batteries are really sad. Got to get a new camera that charges because this is sad. All right. Well, that's how many batteries died, excluding two that are in me in this camera now and one battery left. Which, to be honest, these batteries are so awful, I might just throw them out. So thanks for nothing, CVS. All right. Well. You got that man entirely wrong. I have some extra battery power left for these two seconds. And that's the end result. I'm going to do some cleanup. But I pretty much ran down the rest with my car. And made it look okay. I left some spots for me and I'm gonna be shoveling out a little bit more for my lady and that should be good good enough to go to work I need another shower fun and that's all for today because I'm about to lose this so have fun New Hampshireites check me out Landship Scorpius on Facebook like, subscribe. I don't have anything fun to send off with, so this is gonna have to be it. Please enjoy my really sad credits until I can make better credits.
much for watching my videos. Subscribe if you don't want to see more videos like this because I'm bored and need something to edit. Probably going to need a new camera because I went through a lot of batteries on just shoveling. And to be honest, once I complain, I haven't been out here that long. So, I'm going to get back to work, shoveling, and uh, I guess I'll see you guys later.